Hey everyone, what's up and welcome back to Dippery Studios. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make this awesome dual monitor setup inside of After Effects. So let's get started. Alright everyone, before we start, I'd just like to make a quick little announcement. I am now posting videos every single Friday, so if you want to get a notification every time a new video comes out, just subscribe and click the little bell icon down there next to the subscribe button. And that's my announcement. Okay, so we're here in After Effects. This is what you should see whenever you open it on screen one. So what you want to do is come up here to the, it's not minimize, but it like makes it into a tab over your screen. Um, you're going to click on that. It'll make it a bit smaller. And then you want to drag it to where it's in between your two screens. And then you can grab each edge you gotta be really careful when you do this. Just go slow and do it on both sides. There we go, just like that. Now you can drag the top. You still gotta be careful, but not as careful with the top. And then on the bottom. Okay, so now that you have everything stretched out across the screen, it's obviously not what we want. So what we're gonna do is drag um drag the project panel, just click on the word project and bring it over here to these blue words on the composition panel. On the preview panel actually. Where it says composition. So now you get this double tab between the two. So now what you're gonna want to do is grab the word none. On the name of the or whatever the name of the composition is on where your timeline is and drag it up um and right here around this when you get it on the edge you should see this green line appear and once you see that then let go and then your timeline will appear on screen and now if you adjust it you should have your composition over here now you could just have the double tab between these two but we could make it even better by dragging the project panel over here and just dropping it smack in the middle. And I'll actually drop it to where you see that blue line right there. And there you go. When you adjust, now when you adjust the line. It's perfect. You can make a new composition over here and then make a new layer and it appears in your timeline and everything works great. And then this is really cool. This is how you can save it to where um, whenever you get your two monitors set up you don't have to set it up every single time. So when you do this little trick that I'm about to show you um, that's how you get the little button up here to to it's kind of a shortcut to let you get to it faster so you're gonna come here to view no nope. you're gonna come here to window workspace and then click as click on save as new workspace and then you could save this as dual monitor Push OK. And now you can see that it appears over there. So this is my old one. Um, the render queue is open. This is my new one. So they're pretty much the same. Um, I'm actually going to delete that. I don't know how to delete it. But anyway, this is the best dual monitor setup uh, I believe you can get. And that's about it for this After Effects tutorial, and I'll see you next time on Debris Studios. Thanks for watching. Bye.